Easy Context Menu is a free and simple app that lets you add and customize commands in the Windows Desktop, File, and Folder Context Menus. So this menu and your Folder Context Menus. It can be downloaded from this website. You want to scroll all the way down to Download and grab the zip. And as you can see, there's a lot of commands that you can add to the context menu with this program and I'll extract and you can put this wherever you want. Here's what it looks like. And you can see these are all the commands by default that you can add to various different context menus. So for the desktop context menu, you can add a command for select all files. And then you want to hit the icon with the plus symbol. Then if you right click the desktop, you'll see a command select all files. And just like that, I have every file on the desktop selected. This will also display in the folder context menu. You can add commands for deleting temporary files, restarting Explorer, hit apply. And then you get this tools menu here and restart Explorer. So that's pretty nice. We got commands for reducing memory, copying your IP. This will copy your actual static IP or the IP address that your ISP gives you. You can add system tools such as the registry, computer management. So I can right click, go to system tools and quickly open computer management right from the desktop or in my folder context menu here. Task manager, command prompt. Snipping tool, control panel, so that's a useful one. Empty recycle bin. And then you get quick access to those. You got power options for turning off the PC, shutdown, restart, hibernate, sleep, lock switch. Some folder specific context menu commands. For example, if you want to open PowerShell. So if I right click a folder, I can open in PowerShell. I will be located in that folder. File context menus like permanent delete. So if I enable that, I can right click and I have a permanent delete option. And of course you can unselect to remove these commands or you can do uninstall all and this will remove all commands that were in the context menu. If you go to this icon with the little broom, this is the context menu cleaner where you can go ahead and modify existing commands that are added from Windows and other applications such as 7-Zip like I have here. You can enable, disable, or delete. And if you click on this icon, the list editor, you can modify all the commands available to easy context menu as well as add your own commands. Let's say for whatever reason you wanted to open a particular program like maybe Firefox. If I go to add new and locate that program, I now have Firefox command available to me where I can change the name in the context menu, add parameters, run as administrator, and set the position the command is in the menu. If I hit save changes and then locate that program, enable that, and now when I right click, I can quickly open Firefox and this can be done with any program or script. Speaking of script, I have a script here called net backup that I use to back up to the cloud and various other storage across my PC and network. I like to be able to open this script from the context menu as well. So I'll go to list editor. I'll go ahead and add the program. In this case, it's going to be PowerShell, PowerShell seven, and then for the parameter, I'll just add file and then locate the path for the script. Hit save. Then I can come down here and go ahead and change the name actually. Call it net backup. Enable my net backup script. Apply. And now when I right click, I can run my script. One thing I also want to point out is if you have configured your context menus in such a way that you'd like to keep them, you can save all of your settings and load them in another instance or another installation. So you never lose your settings. 
And that's a quick look at easy context menu for Windows. If you like my content, consider becoming a YouTube member. Get early access to new content or consider becoming a Patreon member and get access to exclusive content too hot for YouTube.